Hey everybody and welcome to the birthday live demo. Danielle and I are together this evening. We went and had dinner and had some fun and so we decided to do a live video on the VIP group. So this is a special demo just for the VIP members and we're going to start out with a card and a meaning. The card that we pulled is loving compassion. This card invites you to bring more loving to the situation at hand, whether it's toward yourself or someone connected to the question, which there was no question with this. So someone may be connected to you. Uh, it may imply a need for forgiveness or for seeing things from a fresh, more expansive perspective. This card is re a reminder that you are loved and have infinite access to the gentle yet powerful force of loving compassion as and when you need it. To bring yourself back into your heart, think about those you love and moments with them where you have felt joy. Expand this feeling out to more and more people, creatures and places, until the whole planet is infused with this beautiful, warm and loving feeling. Nice, yay! <laughs> so, love is the message for my birthday. Happy birthday! Yay! We're going to start out, and Daniela is going to demonstrate the Enviro cloth and the glass cloth. And we're going to clean her stove, and she is using the, what is that? The, this is the degreaser. It's the heavy-duty degreaser. And what I do is I just do a little bit into some water in one of the Norwex bottles. So, so you can see that. Let's go ahead and I'll spray the stove down, and then I've got to get the microfiber wet. Left it nice and nasty for you guys. <laughs> yep. I think I think her other half was making hamburger today. Yeah. So that's probably in there too, a little bit from him fixing his dinner. And so she's getting that nice and wet. Wring it out. Fold it up. And you guys got to see what it looked like before she's doing her nice wipe down, scrub down. You know, so she's, you know, you just do a little bit of elbow grease here and there, but it really doesn't take that much. Mm -hmm. And anytime, yeah, yeah, you come across a little something, you can feel it with the microfiber, and then you just scrub it till it's up. It comes right up. A few crumbs everywhere as well, but. Of course. And now you're using the Enviro cloth. Mm-hmm. Was that one of the sets that you got as a hostess gift, this, if I recall? This one was, yes. Yeah. This is the one with the pretty purple, and then it comes with this, uh, it's got the flowers on it. The, the glass, glass one? Yeah. yeah. Now, those are hostess gifts, I believe, and, you know, it's really simple to get if you what? Host a party. Yeah. I like to call them demonstrations. I don't like to call them parties because we're helping you learn. We're helping you get a knowledge about... Um, hey, V, glad you could make it. Thanks for the birthday wish. There we go. She's got the glass. Whenever I, yeah, I get done with the, the cleaning. I just come back over real quick and make sure I don't have any streaks. And you can see, especially up in here, it'll actually get rid of any of those streaks. It'll dry just completely streak-free. Doesn't matter if it looks like there might be some left. There won't be when I am done. So there is, quick and easy, much better looking stove. Yep. Yep. Now, if you used the paste cleaner, mm -hmm. have you done that on this to I help? I have. I have, and I've that? actually removed quite a bit of excess stuff on there with the paste stuff, but we do have some damage to our stove that just doesn't come off. Okay, so, okay. Yeah. But look how much nicer it's looking. Look at how that shines, everybody. Isn't that awesome? Mm -hmm. This is so much fun. <laughs> so I can see reflection in the... <laughs> <laughs> awesome. Okay, what else are you going to tell us I'll, about? I'll tell you what, about this little guy here. So we use the Norwex um, filter in their water system, and it's it's fantastic. Absolutely love it. We go ahead and just right here up at the top, you can see you open and close this little guy. Open it up to put your water in. Pour the water in, and right here, you can see that every time I open and close that, right there, it knocks it down. It basically lets you know that every time you've used it, it brings that number down. I think we start at 90, if I remember right. And then after a total of 90 uses, um, you'll need to replace the filter in it. Okay. So I typically will take, fill it up from my sink, 
and then use this to fill up some jugs in my uh, fridge so I have cold water. Nice. Now, does that have one or two filters in it? This has just one filter. Okay. Let me show you. I'll pull it apart here. Oh, gosh. It's stuck. There we go. Gosh. I didn't do that, but... So this is what it looks like. And this guy in here is the actual filter. And every time you go to change it, I mean, it's that simple. That's how it comes in the package. You just plop it in. And anytime you get a new one, you want to run some water through it before you start drinking it right away. But then take out the old, throw it away, put in the new, plop it in, run a little bit of water so it gets all of that, uh, any of the yuck that might be in the filter. So you get that out first and then you're good to go. You've got 90 fill ups here. So, nice, nice. Yeah. Now I find that I like to use water filters and it really doesn't even matter if I have good water where I live. I like to filter my water just to be on the safe side. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Awesome. And I told Danielle we we're going to do this quick and easy tonight, but I see over there you have the three cutting boards. Oh, we can do more. Can we this. talk about those cutting mm -hmm. boards? I love, 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 love these, are these cutting boards. So check them out. This is the mini. This is the newer one. And this has got your nice on the back side here so it won't move around when you're going to cut and do. And I think that's a silicon. Um, on the back there? Yeah. Okay. And um, I like that they have the rim. Mm -hmm. So like if you're doing, say you're doing a little batch of strawberries or you're doing something like that, and the juices will actually roll into this versus all over my counter, which, mm -hmm. okay, April mm -hmm. has done. Mm -hmm. <laughs> But then, they, yeah, we have the three different sizes. They came out with that smaller one, and these are the other two that they've normally had. You've this is the small one, correct? Yes. Me mini, mini, small, small, and then I guess regular? Large. large. I think it might be called large. Okay, yeah. But you can see by comparison how she had them sitting there on the wall. Mm -hmm. Comparison on the size. You've got three really great sizes. I know on the large one... We used that when we were doing, what gathering did we use this at? Was it Thanksgiving? Yeah. When we used this one, and it was so nice to be able to carve on it and to... Yeah, it was perfect. To, yeah, and, and it worked really, really well. And all three of them have this, so you could, like, hang them mm -hmm. if you wanted to, or if you wanted to put them in a... Um, yeah, one of those little things. What right, are they I can't think. <laughs> it's easy to grab a hold of them. Right, with that, but they all have the silicone rim, silicone, silicone. Yeah, rim that I like because I can't stand a cutting board that slides. I just mm -hmm. cannot. And all of these have it, so they don't slide, and then that way they're um, they're nice to secure on your countertops. Mm -hmm. And um, what I like too is they don't dull my knife. Did you notice that? Mm -hmm. Yeah. They don't tend to dull my knives, and you don't get chunks. So, like, if you're cutting on this, you're not going to get like you get with a plasticky or mm -hmm. a wooden cutting you board where you'll get the that. line. Yep, and you can see no... there's nothing. Mm -hmm. And it's not like she doesn't use her cutting boards because, unlike her mother, she does actually cook, cook occasionally. <laughs> yeah. and, and cut things. And, like, you know, I, I'm trying to find. And you can't because they just don't jig up. They don't flake up. They don't make little pieces of plastic or mm -hmm. wood chips in your food. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know, those kind of things are great. And I know I'm covering a few of the... You need a new one. A new one what, V? <laughs> she says, I need a new one. <laughs> <laughs> um, and um, that's what I like about it. And tonight we wanted to kind of show you some of the stuff that's a little bit different than like your safe haven, than your other products that you can get we want to go outside of the that a little bit with my birthday party mm -hmm. and remember i'm offering all those great prizes to those who take part tonight um and order off of the demonstration either this demonstration or the jump start demonstration and this bottle is a norwex bottle mm -hmm. and you know what i like about the one i have and i don't know if you notice a difference daniela is this bottom Oh, yeah. It's fantastic, I isn't mean, it? you don't... It it's doesn't look... It's not going to go anywhere. It's not going to fall over. It's not going to slide. Mm -hmm. It's... It, you know, look at that. And I love that it when you spray it, it gives you your, like... Fo you saw that on the stove. I mean, it completely covered the stove in that foamy type spray. So, it's like a penetrating, deeper, thicker type clean that's going to get in cutting there. Cutting board. And yep. I love the cutting boards, V. Yeah. Awesome. What oh, other... Yeah. Bo what other thing you got over there? Oh, Lord. I have everything from Norwex. I spend way too much money. 
I never, love never. all of it so much. This is the bamboo cloth, if you want to check oh, this nice, out. Oh, nice, nice. I have a few people who've asked about the bamboo. What? Talk to me about that. What do you use that so for? So, you just like I use the Enviro cloth. It's very similar. It's a similar in size. So, here, let me hold. This is the wet Oh, it Enviro has a little cloth. different feel. It has a bit of a different texture to it. So, you can see it's very similar in size. It's a little bit smaller, maybe. So, that's the Enviro cloth. But this, I, I use it the same way. I do the Enviro cloth and it's got those little bit of ridges in it that helps with picking up stuff. And I mean, I've dirtied this thing and you can see after getting it in and out of a wash, it looks great. I mean, I, seriously, black, yucky, dirty from cleaning the inside of the oven. Look at it. You know, this is, it, I, it's one of my favorite rags. So it's, it sits in the kitchen on a regular basis. So yeah, yep. that's the bamboo cloth. Nice. If you haven't seen that, we also have the dish liquid that we use on a regular basis over here. This one, I really liked the um, one that came out, the lavender rose. So I got a couple of those while it was still available. Hey, Connie. Good to see you, hon. Thanks for coming to my birthday demo. <laughs> and then there's another. She's got another got, spray bottle. Yeah, this is, so I use this particular spray bottle for um, the soap. You, they, they came out with, um, here, let me grab it thing under the counter here. It's called the Bi Biozyme, right? I don't know if I'm saying that right. But I put that in this guy and then I can come over here if you want to maybe, that sink is kind of dirty. We could do that real quick. As you can see, it just sprays your dish soap, so to speak, this, which is similar to a dish soap, onto your surface so it can like soak and penetrate and help you clean it better. So that's that. I also use over here if you want to just get this. I know the background is yucky. Sorry. I love this guy. I usually will take and put my sponges that I have from Norwex and they'll just go right here and they work perfect right and it there. it drains them so they don't yep. get stinky. And then I just clean out this guy every now and then because a little bit of water will get in there. And we also got this little guy here, which I use to keep to clean my glasses and stuff out. And then we've got this to clean into different creases and crevices and their little cream stuff. I love this stuff as well. It's like that paste, it's really good. So hey, talk to me about those sponges. Are we gonna use one of those in the sink? Oh, uh, we can. These are actually pretty dirty. <coughs> um, and they'll need eventually replaced here, but that they, right there is what I use at my house all the time. I love it's this spiry, one. spiry sponge. I think it's yep. called. Yeah, I got the container down there. We can look at the it bottle too. It has just but... enough little grit that it cleans stuff, but it's not going to mar up like your your stainless steel. Yeah, it is so much nicer than those. Oh my gosh, and they last a long time too. So, I mean, there you go. Bloop bloop bloop. Look how quick easy that was, guys. Oh my god, I could even do that. <laughs> <laughs> you clean the house now, Mom? No. <laughs> Let me grab under here, I've got uh, some of the boxes. So yeah, we have the Enviro sponge. That's the other one. Which is this little guy. It's a little different. This one that I have is actually one of the specials. It comes in purple and blue. Okay. Where this, I this is all, it's a really hard one between these two. These are my favorites. This is great for scrubbing. This is also great for scrubbing. And you've got this side with a little softer. That's your like Enviro your, cloth. It exactly, has the Enviro cloth exactly. on the back side. So. And um, I like them. Um, I know that a couple other folks that I work with like the Enviro sponge a little better than the Spiri sponge. Yeah. But I like the oh. Spiri sponge because, like I said, it does that little extra grit for me. And you guys all have to remember, I live in a house where I have... Yeah, see how nice and shiny they are when you first get them? Oops. You know what the great thing is? You can throw those right in the washer, mm -hmm. and they they come out perfectly clean like they're not even been used. Mm -hmm. It's you amazing. You use them for a while. That's, they do last. Yeah. You know, so. And I, uh, what I like about it is I live in such a teeny tiny space that I like to be able to um, um, be able to wipe things down and know that I'm getting it quick and easy. Mm -hmm. Are you going to wipe that sink out with your glass cleaner or glass rag so we can see how shiny it sure. made your sink? I can do that. I wanted to show you guys this too. We have one of the kitchen towels here that this is one Check of the, out the newer size colors. Of those. Catch out the side. I love the size of those. It's it's great. It's perfect. It's yeah. It's the perfect kitchen towel. Yep. I, I usually leave this like hanging here on the on the stove. You know what I mean. Then you just come over and dry your hands to using the paper. She towel. had some of the people in her house be bad, and they put some of her cloths <gasps> where they shouldn't have, and yes. they got little burn marks on them. So she's trying to keep those ones some hidden of, yeah, from you. Those ones are over <laughs> here. Mostly don't need to look at those. They they might have to rebuy those, but. So this, yeah, I mean, real quick here. Look how nice and clean and shiny. I mean, I don't necessarily usually did. use like this inside the sink. I would use this more like, you know, let's show you how shiny we get. Right. But I mean, you just did the cleaning of the sink. Right. So that's why I'm like, let's right. show how nice and shiny that looks. 
But look at that. Isn't that awesome, guys? When we first got these, we were skeptical when we first started playing with Norwex. And she has some pictures across this, the be the kitchen here. And they were had grease speckles from just being in the air. And she, um, we took and we did the Enviro cloth on them. And then she put the glass cleaner on them. She goes, oh, my God, they're cleaner than they've ever been. I've never. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. <laughs> so it's amazing. And then yes. I have a cousin, actually, who had found some old Tiffany-type lamps on the street and she brought them home and cleaned them with the norwax rags and she goes they're gorgeous they're absolutely gorgeous yeah yeah no it is it's fantastic that it's it's such a tightly there's so much extra fiber to it how they make these i mean it's there's got, no microfiber that will ever compare this right is, it doesn't even feel like microfiber no, this is amazing right and then what i like too is the um they have the the silver in them Yes. And I had it described to me as what they do is the silver is actually molten and it's heated into the threads of your cloths. So it's not like you have a single thread that's going through your cloths, but it's a molten silver that's actually in the cloth. So, anyhow, we just wanted to come on and say happy birthday party with me. Mm -hmm. And remember the specials and the gifts and the prizes and the drawings that I'm offering to everybody. And, um, you know, if you're going to place an order, do it before, I think, what would you say, midnight tomorrow. And you can get into the drawings of the specials that I'm doing. These are only my specials. They're not, don't ever expect them from Norwex to be these specials. They're mine. <laughs> these are specifically my specials. And... To those that were able to make it, thank you. And go back and listen at the beginning. Isn't that a pretty set? Oh, my gosh. I love this is. one. Here, I'll show you real quick. Since we're still on, I mean, this is gorgeous, isn't this? Oh, that one looks a little smaller. Is that a little no, smaller? No, they're, they're, I, I know it looks like it, but it's not. Here, I'll, let me get the other one. I'll show you. They're, oh, they are the, the same. same size. Yeah. The, it's the just glass, the design looks yeah. makes it look a little tiny. The oh, that's glass so cool. ones are big, but I love this one. Isn't that pretty? That is so pretty. Yeah. That is so pretty. V says that's so cute. Thanks for the birthday wish, Connie. Um, and also, um, what was I going to say? Oh, go back and let, watch this replay on this video when it comes back up on. Because we did pull a card to start the, um, the get-together out. Yeah. And it was, what was it called? Loving Compassion. Loving, Loving Compassion. And that just so fits for what I really hope for the world um, on my birthday. And I just think that's really cool that that card came up. Well, ladies, thanks for joining in, and there is a link in the VIP group here. If you'd like to order off of tonight's demo and tonight's party, we appreciate it. And it's been great seeing you all and talking to you all, and have an awesome rest of your day. Bye-bye.